Lindsay Smith from the Lindsay Smith Group. I'm sitting here with Jeff Hayes from Hayes Plumbing. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Lindsay, how you doing? Good to yeah. see you. Now, Jeff, you're the owner operator of Hayes Plumbing. That's right. Hayes okay. Plumbing and Bathroom Renovations. Oh, perfect. Yeah. How long have How long has Hayes Plumbing been around? It's been incorporated since 1978. So you're a licensed plumber, correct? <laughs> yes, I am. And how long have you been licensed? Yeah, since 97. Since 97. So you've been doing this a long time. Yeah, a couple of moons. Yep. Yeah. Okay. For sure. And you bought the company in 2012 from your That's father. Right. Yep. I bought it since 2012. That's okay. right. So, so your your role with the company really, I think, from my perspective, is. Um, you manage the business, manage the team, and is that correct? Yeah, now basically uh, do estimates and uh, if the fellows need a hand on the job, whatever, I can have a hand with that as well. Okay, so you basically start the process by doing the quotes for the customer, helping them design whatever high-end renovation they're going to do. Yeah, that's right. Or replacing a set of laundry tub tabs. Yeah, replacing the galvanized pipe under the house. Exactly. The insurance company doesn't like it. So, so that's, for that, you manage the team, and um, that's kind of your, your role. However, I think you had told me recently that one of the issues you're running into right now is you've got tools in your hand. Yeah, I've been on the tools probably more in the last few months than I have been in the last 10 years. So talk to me about that. Why are you on the tools yeah, again? Because we need more plumbers. I, I would hire two today if I could find, uh, find some good plumbers. So How long have you struggled trying to find for trades? Years. For years, we, for years we've been trying, it's been a shortage that the whole industry is experiencing. Okay. Frankly. Now, so if you were to find a plumber, um, like what's the, kind of the range of uh, what uh, plumber, plumbers are making today? It's going to range right. anywhere from the 20s to the 30s. Some of them are even paying up into the 40s if you get into Toronto. Okay. Yeah. So these are high paying jobs. Yes. Benefits? Yes. Benefits, fan, take home. There's always that argument about do I go to, does, does my, my kid go to university or do they go into the trades? Right. So we know that if you go to the university, you have, an, you have a chance of getting a job, but it's not guaranteed. Yeah. What are the chances of getting a job if you if you got, became a plumber, started in the track of becoming a, a licensed plumber, what's the chances of getting hired? I would say pretty much 100%. Okay, so. yeah, for, and it's not just for, for men, it's for men and women both. We need to get more women in the trades too. Wow. Yeah. So this is like, this is a, there's no guarantees in this world, but this is a pretty good chance of pretty as close as you can get. Here, can you That's, get right. Job, That's right. right. Here's what I need. I need your help. I need to hire two new plumbers uh, as soon as possible. If you have any family or friends that are in the trade uh, and they're getting tired of driving to Toronto every day and wasting 10 hours or more a week driving in and out of the city, um, please give them my um, net number or my email address, which will be on the screen underneath here. And uh, we'd be happy to set up an interview and hopefully we can we can hire you. Thanks.